And the scorching heat was also causing havoc closer to the city. Our hottest day for the summer affected many gum trees, including one that landed on a vehicle almost hitting its driver. Lucky to be alive, David Talbot assesses the damage after a falling branch smashed his car early this afternoon. Big bang, I thought at first that another vehicle had hit me and then as I looked up it was the tree falling over. The gum tree branch fell directly on the children's seat. Fortunately on this trip he was alone. A little bit shaken, just glad I'll still see Christmas. Neighbours say this isn't the first time gum trees have caused serious problems at Flagstaff Hill. They come down all the time, so the one behind you came down about a year ago and one sort of banged in the back of our place two years ago. This afternoon there was a similar incident in North Adelaide. This time Leo Voigt was inches away from disaster. The tree branch was sort of drooping in the wind and I thought it was just the wind coming through and then the next thing I knew the tree branch just dropped and landed on the front of my car. It's believed both trees may have fallen victim to today's extreme heat. Adelaide sweltered through its hottest day in almost two years with the mercury rising to 42 degrees. Paramedics issuing the usual warnings. Wear light clothing, wear sunblock, keep a hat on and make sure you keep your fluids up. It wasn't only people who sweltered in the scorching sun, zookeepers were kept busy caring for the critters. The sea lions played with their icy treats while our feathered friends enjoyed a cooling shower. Fortunately there is some relief in sight. Forecasters predict a cool change to arrive sometime this evening, producing temperatures in the mid-20s for the next few days. Jack Paquetta, Nine News.